Hello, in this video I'll be going over how to set up your GoGuardian account. You're going to start off by going to GoGuardian.com and you're going to click on sign in. You're going to skip everything at the top and just go straight to log in with Google. And when you log in, you're going to be logging in with your new account, your BambergSchools.org account. The first time in, you may have to accept the terms of service. So you'll just read through this and go all the way down to the bottom and click the accept, click the next one, and it will bring you into your GoGuardian account. Now, the next thing you'll need to do is you're going to import your Google Classrooms. If you don't have Google Classrooms, go do that first. You need to pull in your Google Classrooms. That's the way it's going to organize it. So I'm going to click import Google Classroom and notice it says there's no classrooms available because I have to click here to it says reconnect but to connect your Google account to the classes. So I'm going to click on that and again I'm going to choose my BambergSchools.org and I'm going to allow and now when I click on import Google Classroom now it found my classes. All I need to do is select the ones that I want to import and click import and it will create my classes for me. So now that I have them here, I could simply just come in here and click start class anytime I wanted to monitor. But in order to make sure that you're not controlling a student that is in another teacher's class, I highly suggest that you go to settings for each class, go to edit class, then go to scheduling and add a schedule. So for example, if this class met from eight to 9.30 every day, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, I'm gonna add that to the schedule. And you can see that each day during that time, it will automatically come on and monitor. Even if I'm not on the website, it will monitor and it will give me reports on, on what students have been doing during my class. So that's all I have to do for that and I'm ready to go. So I can go back to my classrooms and do the same thing here. Go to edit class, go to scheduling, create a schedule for that class and I would do that for every one of my classes. I'll be sending out another video on how to actually monitor class, open and close tabs for students, set up scenes, different things like that. But for now, this should get you started, and if you have any questions, please feel free to contact me. Thanks so much for watching.